Going the other way, Martin. Oh! Razzle dazzle! Jarrell Martin with a grown man's move to the rim. Jarrell Martin putting some sauce on that thing in transition, paying homage to J.R. Ryder's 1994 slam in the dunk contest. He coined that one the East Bay Funk. How about the onions on this Martin kid? It takes such a risk in a tie ball game. It gets mad love for me. Hello, welcome to the Campus Insider Studios. I'm Jordan Cornette. Here's the thing, Martin knew exactly what he was doing. This wasn't reckless immaturity. It's a kid who realized his team had choked off a 13-point lead. They needed a lift. They said the dunks were two points. That's coming from a guy who's never dunked a basketball. It's inaccurate. Depending on the quality of the dunk, it's worth so much more. It gets the crowd hype, get your team more energized, and it shifts momentum. It did exactly that as LSU went on a 9-0 run after Martin's exclamation point. The result? They won 70-63, to and this team's on the bubble. That game, that play, the difference. Most impressive, it's happened before. This isn't the first time the 6'10 sophomore went between the legs in a game and let the crowd know what time it was. How about a little deja vu? Here he is in an AAU game back in his high school days doing the same exact dunk. Take a look. Give it to him! Showtime! Oh my goodness! You got to be kidding me! I mean, how about the play-by-play -play from the faceless guy in the stands? It's just impressive to me, a 6'10 guy so seamlessly can execute a dunk like that, the coordination. One thing is for certain, Drell Martin has never changed. The dunk of the year goes to Mr. Martin, no snub there. But there are some potential snubs we're talking about that are lingering come Selection Sunday. Check out some of the teams I have not dancing, but they should be. You can only find it on the digital tip, campusinsiders.com.